Oh, hey there, YouTube. I'm back again today for another game review. And today, I'm very excited to check it out. Go Bananas from Game Right. This is for two to five players, ages six plus. It'll take about, I don't know, 10, 15 minutes to play. And in Go Bananas, you are going to be playing a modified version of Slapjack where you're going to be trying to slap gators and slap splat bananas, I should say, and capture monkeys and try to get all the cards in the deck. It's a light, simple family slash children's game, but is it good? Let's open it up and I'll tell you what I think. All right then we're going to take a look at what you're going to get inside of Goo Bananas. So first and foremost, we're going to have a handy dandy rule sheet. You're only going to need this page right here. The rest of it is in various different languages. And uh, overall, it'll teach you how to play the game very quickly. I can also teach, play, teach you how to play the game right now because it is a very light, simple game. So in Go Bananas, you are going to try and get all the cards that are out on the table. So when you first start the game, you're going to deal out piles of cards evenly to all the players. Uh, then what you're going to do is we'll take a look at the cards before we get started. So you're going to have monkeys doing various different things. You're going to have gators, and then you are going to have bananas in here spread out. There's also wilds, as you can see right there. And everyone is going to flip over a card at the exact same time. So you go one, two, three, then everyone is going to flip over a card like this. And at this point, you have to slap something on the table if there are matches. So there's three different ways that you can get matches. So first, if you have a fresh banana and you have a rotten banana on the table like so, then you slap both of them and you say splat. And if you do that, you gain both of those piles and you put them on the bottom of your deck like so. You've gained those cards, good for you. You also can get gotcha gators. So there's gators in here. Now this isn't a very good example. Let's say this is out here. So there's different numbers of on gators. And if you had a four monkey out here and a gator out here and you slap both of them, you go gotcha gator, you would get both of these piles of cards and you would put them on the bottom of your deck. Last but not least, there are of course monkeys. Monkeys, monkeys, and more monkeys. And you are looking for opposite color monkeys. So for instance, if this or what we had out here, let's just say these are the four cards we had out here, you could say, go bananas, and then you'd want to slap these two because they have opposite colors, and then you would get both of those cards. However, what will happen sometimes is you will slap the wrong cards, and you'll say, uh, go bananas, and you'll be like, oh, these are different colors. If that's the instant, then you're going to take the top card of your deck, you're going to put it on the bottom of your pile, and you will continue to go forward until someone has every single pile out there. So, got your gators, go bananas, and splat or what you're going to be doing in the game. Also, there's a special two-player variant. So if you're playing two players, then each player will have two piles of cards. So you'll you'll be doing like this. So there'll be four out there at a time. But anywho, you're going to go until continue until every, someone has all of the cards, at which point they will be the winner of the game. And that, in a nutshell, is how you're going to play Go Bananas. Alrighty then, Go Bananas from Game Right. What are my final thoughts? Let's go with the pros, let's go with the cons. First, on the con side, game's not going to be for everybody for a variety of different reasons. First and foremost, if you're not in the market for a family or children's game, this is obviously not going to be for you. Next, I also liked it best at the medium to lower player counts. With five players, you just didn't have enough cards in your hand, especially if a kid just doesn't slap anything in time then they could be out of the game really quickly which is another con that i have this game is that there is player elimination the game goes by so quickly it says 12 minutes which i'd say is about right that it's not a huge deal but for kids you know player elimination well i'm out of the game sorry kid whatever should have splatted faster um it's light it's simple you need to know into this go into this knowing that it's only for children's and families and that's what i got on the con side moving on to the pro side go bananas is a perfectly serviceable fun little family game that i can recommend and i will be keeping for the time being i mean as you can see by the box being just beat up to heck this has got a lot of play in my classroom i think you can play it with kids four or five years old so ignore the ages six plus and they're gonna have a good time with this game you're gonna have a good time with this game it's fun this game kind of messes with your brain especially at five players when there's just so much stuff out there to compartmentalize and you're trying to do it as quickly as possible and you'll make mistakes you're like oh that was such a stupid mistake but then you'll realize that two other people at the table make that mistake those are fun moments to have with the kids you're playing and they're going to enjoy those moments as well it's easy to learn it's easy to teach it plays quickly uh, I like the bright, colorful artwork, and overall, Go Bananas is a fun, enjoyable game. It feels like a mass market style game. It definitely does, but for what it is, I think it's fun enough that you and your family are going to have a good time with it. If you can find it on the cheap, definitely recommend this one, and it's a little tuck box here, so I imagine it's cheap as well anyway. Uh, so Go Bananas, fun one from Game Right, another solid hit from them. 
If you enjoyed this review, please be sure to click on that subscribe button down below in the comments below. Let me know. Bananas, yay or nay. For me personally, oh, yes, 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 I love bananas. Frozen bananas, uh, warm bananas, you know, bananas on ice cream. I got this machine called the Yo Nanas where you stick frozen bananas in it and it pops out banana ice cream, which is delicious. Uh, you know, the bananas with the chocolate all over them and then the oh, banana splits. I love, love, love bananas. But do you like bananas? Let me know in the comments below. And as always, thanks for your time, YouTube.